Dub Nation was popping, y'all. It's your boy A Dub, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Guys, I'm really, really excited this morning. I'm on my way to drop off the two sheets t-shirts that I made for a client. I'm actually meeting them. And um I kind of don't like meeting clients because it takes gas money and that takes away from your profits. But sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, guys. And um when you are doing your independent business, your side hustle, your 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 whatever you want to call it, when you're doing that, right? What you gotta realize, and I'm eating cookies, yeah, bad. What you gotta realize is these small like one and two t-shirt deals when you sell t-shirts to people when you make like, hey, make me five t-shirts, make me three t-shirts, they are paramount, especially when you're starting your business like I am and like you don't have like a, I got regular clients that always get t-shirts from me, right? And what I'm realizing is that when I get paid, right, when I get paid now, um, my money that I use throughout the weeks, right? I'm starting to touch my bank account less and less. I'm starting to touch my debit card less and less. And that's a good thing because that lets me know that my paycheck is finally starting to become my paycheck that I can save or like pay my big bills with and stuff like that. And the money that I'm getting from, from um, doing these small deals with different clients is going towards lunch. I'm um, going towards gas. Woo! Going towards lunch. Going towards gas. I'm putting some away. Like if you get a, a quite a few of these little small, make me a shirt, make me three shirts here and there, then in the long run, your money's gonna start adding up. I promise you that. I promise you that. So just be mindful of that. Just be aware of that, huh? Got a whole lot to show you today. Make sure you subscribe. Got a whole lot to show you. Stay tuned in. Make sure you hit that bell too. Welcome to the show. Thank you. These are shirts. For some reason, you had um, a black shirt in there. You know that, right? Yeah, it was, it was an extra shirt in there. So, check them out. All right, guys, deal is done. So I just tried to go live a little while ago. Some of you guys might have just saw that. That was a huge, <laughs> epic fail. I just refused to plug in the Ethernet cord. I, I'm, from now on, when I go live, I'm just not even going to go live unless I can plug in the Ethernet cord. That's it. <sighs> I give up. So let me talk to you all for just a quick second, man, because i got to get something off my chest, guys. You know what I love the most about this platform and about being able to communicate with you guys and give you guys different information, man? Like, people have been hitting me up on social media lately and I so, so appreciate it. I, I love interacting with you guys. You guys hit me up on Facebook. You guys hit me on, up on Instagram. Just hit me up with whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish. If, if you feel like I can, um, you know, be of service to you of any kind, I love that you guys are patronizing me and I appreciate it so much because God knows we all can use any little bit of extra income that we can. But guys, the thing that I love the most out of everything is when I put out content, seeing you guys use what I tell you to do on social media and seeing the products that you guys are putting out and seeing that you guys are actually using this stuff in real life to make money. That is like the best feeling ever. Like money can't replace that. Like knowing that I help somebody is like, I, I, can't, I can't explain it guys. Like, so I just want to thank y'all for, um, for just doing that, for like, you know, taking the, cause there's two types of people. Online people give out information all day, every day. And there's only two types of people. People are that are gonna listen to the information and just talk about it and say what they're gonna do. And the second person is the person that's gonna take action and actually do it. I'm seeing a lot of doers out here and you are never going to accomplish your goal unless you become a doer. So shout out to all the doers, man. Dub Nation, y'all are doers, man. 
and I appreciate it. Y'all make me feel good just by just by sharing the creativity that you guys are, are, are the things that you're doing with the information that I'm telling you. I, 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 it's no better feeling in the world just to feel like you help somebody. Like it sounds cheesy, sounds corny, but it really brings me happiness deep down inside, man. I like for real. It's just so weird. Like it's crazy. Like ah. All right, guys. I appreciate you. All right, so on another note, right? I had an epiphany and um, this is for all you younger entrepreneurs and you older entrepreneurs also, but every time I have an epiphany and it's of value, I wanna share it with you guys. So I'm gonna let you guys know that it's really common sense, but it's like you don't, sometimes common sense is not so common. Sometimes common sense is like easy things that we, don't even pay attention to this common sense. This is what I've realized, right? Look around you, look around your community, look around at us and what we do and, and as far as money is concerned, right? Listen to this gem that I'm about to give you guys and, and, and take heed and really, really, really digest what I'm about to tell you. You will never make it to the next level financially you will never be financially comfortable you will never be wealthy you will never be well off money wise if every time you make money you spend it all right so you have a certain amount of bills that you like to, uh, you have a certain amount of money that you spend each month so that that's your that's your spending have it and you got you got you might have a car note you might have a house you might have this this is if when you make money you increase your bills like when you get a raise at your job or when you, when you start selling more stuff online then you go buy the next best car which makes your car note higher or you know you get a contract of some sort and then you go buy a bigger house when your expenses start to raise with your money, you're breaking even financially and you, you're, you're remaining in the same spot, in the same place. When you start making more money, you should, your finances should stay the same or decrease. And that's the only way you can see more money. Then when you get up some ideas, you can use that extra money that you have to fuel those ideas and make you even more money. You understand what I'm saying? But I'm gonna say this, as a people, all of us, I'm not talking, I'm, 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 I'm talking to us, but I'm also talking about all of us because everybody's guilty of it. When you get a raise at a job, a lot of people go out and buy like something that's gonna pull from that raise instead of leaving everything the same, right? and putting that extra money in our pocket or putting that extra money in an investment or something like that. And that's what I realized I had this epiphany and I wanted to share with you guys because I think that you guys, especially you young entrepreneurs can, can benefit from this. When you start making more money doing your side hustle or whatever it is, make sure you're not increasing your spending habits. Your spending habits should stay the same or decrease in order for you to make gains um, in life and become in a, in a better financially stable situation. Use that money to pay off credit card debt. Use that money to pay down on, on whatever you need to pay down on as far as like, you know, your bills are concerned and then use the rest to reinvest in your business, to educate yourself, to take some courses or to just put away to build your saving, to build your financial empire. All right, so that's the epiphany that I had, guys. So um, just want to share with you guys. So I am over here in the embroidery and sewing room, and I am building my little inventory of black bear shirts, some to give away and some sell guys um it takes a long time to make each of these shirts each of these shirts take maybe about 45 minutes to make it's crazy 
but whatever I enjoy doing it it's art and um and it's gonna bring me a great return maybe not on my investment you know not not a great return on my investment but it's worth it to me because I'm building my business but I'm about to show you guys for some guys who have cars and are doing this you're doing a t-shirt making thing I'm about to show you guys how you can turn your trunk into your business guys so um make sure you subscribe make sure you guys is tuned in because i'm about to show you what you guys can do and how you guys can arrange arrange it so that no matter where you go you can always pop the trunk and make some money you got to organize it a certain way so it looks good so it looks crisp and i have a few ideas that i'm going to show you soon in the next few videos so make sure you stay tuned make sure you subscribe guys so guys, I think I'm gonna end this live stream here. Um, uh, I gotta get ready to go to work in a little while. So I'm just gonna finish up with this design right here and get ready to go to work. I don't know when you guys are gonna see this video. I planned on uploading it before uh, I went to work, but I don't think I have time to edit it. So I'm just gonna dump the footage on my hard drive and I'll probably edit it while I'm at work and then upload it later on tonight. I'm not sure. Maybe I have enough time to squeeze in a quick edit because it's not a difficult edit, this video right here. I'm probably going to add a little bit of music, bare minimum, and just uh, upload it. So, uh, it's your boy, man. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for everything that you do. Thank you guys for watching videos. Thank you guys for commenting. Thank you guys for liking. Thank you guys for sharing. Thank you guys for following me on social medias. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at King Allen Alexander. Make sure you guys follow, go to my um, Facebook, facebook.com backslash King A Dub and facebook.com backslash A Dub Productions. Follow both pages. Stay tuned, man, because I'm inspired to do more music. I'm inspired to put out music that I've been producing, that I've produced before. I'm inspired to re-release old music, guys. So just stay tuned for everything that's coming up. I told you guys I got a bunch of stuff coming up for you guys. So just stay tuned, revamping the channel, man. It's your boy. This is the merch store, AllenAway.com. Costume Channel Merch, it's your boy, I'm out, man, peace. Turn up that, crank it up. While I listen to the rest, we rockin' with the best, baby.